We're about to six my Nandu Chromatis number two sling that just molted. It's got a fresh molt. Um, this is actually after I uh, sexed it with my microscope. And just to show you kind of a size difference or, you know, the size of the molt that I'm sexing. It's a pretty, pretty small molt. Um, got a leg span pushing um roughly two and a half inches maybe a little less um so uh so yeah let's get to it all right what's up tarantula youtube tennessee tarantula is back with you here we're sexing my two and a half inch nandu chromatis and as you can see plainly from the spermithica um and the fold Epigasket. I can't pronounce that word, but anyway, um, <clears throat> as you can plainly see, it's a female there. Um, we, uh, I love this little microscope. It's absolutely amazing. Um, I played with it and uh, tried to get the best angle I possibly could, and that's that's about as good as I'm gonna get. But, uh, yeah. This is actually the microscope zoomed all the way out. If you can tell by my finger how big the... can't really see too clear. It's not really made for that type of stuff. But, anyway, you can tell how big the sling is. Um, no bull crap. No, uh, no tricks. None of that. I would never do anything like that anyway. Um, let's see here. Back it back up just a little bit. And voila. That's what we were looking at. I don't know if I can get it centered. There we go. Still uh, pretty undeveloped, obviously, on a 2-inch sling. But uh, it is a female. So uh, that's... Uh, that is absolutely epic. I don't know if I can... No, I'm just moving the molt around now. I was going to see if I couldn't stick my... Uh... My dental pick in there and kind of show you exactly where I'm talking about. But... Uh... No, I'm just going to end up moving it all over the place, shaking. Extremely, extremely too bad for this. But, uh, but yeah. There she is. And, uh, hope you guys enjoyed this sexing, little sexing video. And, uh, yeah. I'll, uh, I'll catch you guys next time.